love you. Why are you such a nerd? Why are you wearing your backpack in a fashion front? statement. Why are you doing that? This is, I'm, I'm creating a fashion statement in Belgrade already. Nerd on.
Bani, what do you think about the art of Svetoslav Basara? I think it's very powerful. I think it's extremely suitable to Serbian history and culture. It's beautiful. This is the monument in Belgrade, Serbia, dedicated to our love for French nation, who was very supportive to the Serbian effort in a World War I. Unfortunately, this same monument is a symbol of our undying love for France and French people. Even with all disappointments we have seen in the last decade, when they betrayed us, when they bomb us. Our love still exists and hopefully it will get to their hearts eventually. We are about to enter mid-century fortress of Kalemegdan. And this here is the gate of Karadžorđe. Karadžorđe was the founder of Serbian dynasty Karadžorđević and leader of the Serbian uprising against Ottoman Empire in 1804. And here we are at the Stambul gate, about to enter Belgrade castle. This is inner Stambul gate. After exiting the inner Stambul gate, we are here at military museum where there are military artifacts all the way from the first world war to the very, very last one against NATO. And in front of us is Sahat Tower. This is a Serbian rocket system, NEVA, which was used in the last conflict against NATO. And this is the system that was uh, used when we shut down so-called invisible bomber from United States. As we Serbs like to say, sorry, we did not know it's invisible. Now we are about to enter Belgrade Castle. This is the area where River Sava meets River Danube. We will see that later. And we are now inside the Belgrade, Belgrade Castle. This is from the other side, the famous Sahat Tower. And this here is the famous Bunny Clooney, who is so impressed with... Cannons! Cannons! Yes! And which one is this? Um, I'm just reading it here, it says Barrel of 
So this is from 18th, 19th century, British muzzle loading cannon. And here's Bunny Cooney ready to shoot. Look at the little guy there. So we are now at the upper town of Belgrade Fortress. This area, this whole area is called Kale Megdan. Um, we are going toward the area where there is so-called symbol of Belgrade, uh, Victor statue, which is a uh, work of famous uh, Ivan Mestrovich, and it symbolizes a warrior with a sword and a dove as symbol of the Belgrade really indicates that we are always for peace but ready to fight. Defend. Defend, exactly. We never attack, we only defend our land, land and our people. When attacked. When attacked. And also it's a beautiful area where two great rivers, Sava and Danube, meet each other. And Bunny Clooney on this trip has a goal. Planes, trains, and automobiles. Well, besides that, but one of the goals I'm is visiting three cities, three countries, three countries, and three cities. One will have the Danube, one will have the Sava River, and in Belgrade, I am here to connect the two, Sava and Danube. So, in Ljubljana, Slovenia, we will see Sava. In Austria, Vienna, we, we will Danube. see Danube. But here in Belgrade, those two rivers meet each other. Right? Correct. It's kind of cool. Kinda okay, cool. let's go take a look. And where are we now? So we're at the confluence of where the Danube and the Sava rivers meet. Cool. We introduced you to the Sava and the Danube River and now if you look over there at the end is the Victor Monument, the famous symbol of Belgrade and it's on their national city flag and directly behind it is a new bridge that was built uh, I believe about six years ago um, and it connects... Oh no really, five, five years ago. Okay, but it connects old Belgrade with new Belgrade and it's beautifully lit up at night time as well. Yes. There is a beautiful uh, Sabrina church in the background there. Saborna Church, a home of Duchess Milica, and we hear he, we see here a movie crew getting ready to uh, to shoot a movie. Don't know what movie it is, but whatever it is, it's gonna be cool. It's going to be cool because it's such a awesome surrounding. Absolutely. You like it here, Bunny Clooney? Oh my God, I love the sun. The sun is glorious. Yes. It, it came out for us today when we came yeah, to visit. Yeah, well, yesterday this. was a rainy day. Yeah, but we had fun. I mean, we did the museum. We had the fun, we right? Great, and we today great... we're really lucky with the weather. Yes. Wonderful. Hopefully it continues. Bye, guys. See you again. Bye. Bunny Clooney, what are you doing? Taking yeah. picture? I'm taking amazing Instagram picture. Are you? Yeah. Just let me pull Oh yeah, that's first. pretty cool. And the sun right? is coming right through the gate. Do you see that? And there's water dripping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The war is over. Oh my god, that the is a cool picture. That's an awesome picture. What's your Instagram? Uh, Zeka Girl. Can you spell it? Z-E-K-A-G-I-R-L. So please like, I will be posting not now, but later. So what uh, type of uh, posts do you have on your, inst on your Instagram? Um, they're mostly all from outside, nature pictures, usually a lot of um, 
flowers, trees, things like this that are quite Photography, unique. basically yes. photography is your hobby, right? Yes, very amateurish. But I hope that you put a like on it. I'd appreciate it. Thank you. Bridges of Belgrade. Victor, symbol of Belgrade. Michael Street in Belgrade is a beautiful street full of uh, great architecture. The street doesn't have any cars. You basically walk around and um, it has a great shops. It has a cool, cool stuff all around this city, all around the street. One of my favorite places in Belgrade, Serbia. Come on. Bunny, did you did you enjoy that piece? Yes, it was very touching, and that young girl had so much uh, energy and passion. What was that piece? Well, I asked her after it was called. It's from Sarasota, called Romance in Andalusia, which is a part of Spain. It does have that little bit of a Spanish flavor. Yeah. Wonderful. Thank you. What are you waiting for? Calzone. Calzone, calzone. Here we are at the Tashmaidan Park in Belgrade. And in front of us is the most beautiful sculpture of most loved Serbian patriarch Pavle. Very unique very humble, just the way he was. And in front of us, magnific magnificent Church of St. Mark. This was always my favorite church in Belgrade. Church of St. Mark. In Church of St. Mark lies the body of the greatest Serbian leader who lived from 1308 to 1355 and ruled the greater Serbia, King Dusan the Great. 
eternal memory. So we are looking at the uh, Serbian Parliament, Serbian Parliament building, and Belgrade Postal Office. Where are you, Bunny? Uh, this is the, I believe, the Serbian Parliament building, mm -hmm. the national building. Mm -hmm. uh, this is near. Uh, it's this. The downtown is further away here, but and then there's the city hall, I think, across the street. Yeah, city hall is right in this direction. Posta. Okay, a little bit Serbian today. It's posta. Posta for post office. Correct. Oh. We just came back from St. Mark's Church, which is, which is in this direction down. down there. And here we are at the square of Nikola Pašić, who was a Serbian Prime Minister prior to First World War. And one of the most competent and capable Serbian politicians and Serbian uh, statesmen. He was one of the people who was opposing the Karadžorđević idea of creating Yugoslavia and who simply wanted to create Greater Serbia. Later it had proved to be a right decision for Serbs. Unfortunately they did not follow his recommendations. And here we are at Terazie, across the street, we can see the famous Terazie Cesma. And uh, right next to it, that's Terazie Cesma, and right next to it is the old famous Hotel Moscow. Hotel Moscow. There is Further down, we can see a famous building called the Ograđanka. I'll try to zoom on it, right there. And right now, Bani and I are going to Serbian National Theater to watch a play by a famous Serbian satirist, Branislav Nušić, uh, called Sorrow Family Ožalošćena porodica Sorrow Family Terazije
Shut up. 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 Is there something interesting? So a thousand sheets of crust with raspberry sauce. Is that what intrigues you? Yeah, lots of, look at this Vulcan. It's probably looking like a volcano. What else? Uh, pita sayabukum is pita with uh, apples. Then they have the uh, bresva torta, which is a um, peach tort. Nice. Lots of nice chocolates. And of course, tiramitsu and capri. I don't know you think this is better than Vienna? Oh no. No, you have to still. You still have to go to Vienna. Vienna awaits me. Yes. Even though this seems pretty decent, huh? Well, of course it's decent. It's Belgrade. Okay. Bunny. Where are you? Where are you right now? Huh? Where are you, Bunny? I'm in the Serbian theater. Serbian National Theater. Serbian National Theater. Wonderful. Is this inappropriate, what I'm doing? <laughs> A little bit. <laughs>
And here is the monument to the great Nikolai II, Russian Tsar, great friend of Serbian nation. May he rest in peace forever. Tsar Nikolai II, Russian Tsar. Bunny! So let's read what, it's, what he said here to Alexander Karadjordjevic in July 1914, obviously when Serbia was facing catastrophic First World War. All my efforts will be forwarded, targeted on protecting dignity of Serbia. Under no circumstances, Russia will be indifferent toward the destiny of Serbia. Isn't that beautiful, Bunny? This is uh, Duke Miloš Street. This is, I think, here the uh, tallest building in Belgrade, so-called Belgradjanka. And across the street is Student Cultural Center, which has seen some really awesome rock concerts. The last one I watched was here was uh, Party Breakers performing with Johnny Depp and it was pretty cool. Yeah, that's the Student Cultural Center in Belgrade. And we're going towards Slavia. And here we are at Slavia, Belgrade. Here it says in Cyrillic, Belgrade. And a beautiful fountain in the background. It's a Slavia circle. There is a commercial for Tissot watch. Google, where are we going? Welcome to Berkuni Watches channel. <laughs> what are you wearing? Riso check. What do you have there? Hublo. Hublo. Very nice. 
Ovdje je hrenove slika, e? This is a beautiful uh, Sabrna crkva and uh, Kalemegdan with the Victor lights are on and we are on the river Sava. Well, this is where actually Sava and Danube meet, if you see it in the earlier video. But this is now from the other side and it looks beautiful tonight. Some ducks here. They're sleeping, they're getting ready to sleep. This is an entrance to a beautiful seafood restaurant on the uh, river Danube in Belgrade. And here we go. This is a path to it. So we're now gonna enter the restaurant which is on the water. Koliba. It's called Koliba. See? How cute is that? So this would be Danube on this side and Sava on that side. Yeah, yeah. Suited, suited. All good. Irenice. Irenice. What is this? What's going on here? What is this? English. Okay, sorry. Hello, English. This is perch. From where? From Belgrade. Danube. River Dunav, which is Danube. Sorry, and she's gonna prepare this fresh for us. It just got taken out, so yum yum. And the restaurant was recommended by my brother Guga. Say hi. That's hi. my brother. Hi. Hi. Bear Clooney's brother. Yes. My beautiful brother. I love you, Guga. I love you, Mishko. Hvala. Eto, nice. Sad će oni to da prepare, they're gonna prepare this for us. And we're gonna have some, uh, some uh, calamari. Yes. And we're gonna have a uh, shopska salad. And we're gonna have uh, some roasted peppers. And that's about it. Here we are at truly beautiful Hram of Saint Sava, Church of Saint Sava, which is dedicated to the founder of Serbian Orthodox Church. And uh, as far as I know, this is the largest Orthodox Church in the world. It is magnificent. This beautiful May evening, and uh, you're looking at uh, truly capital project of the uh, government of Serbia with the great help of our Greek and uh, Russian brothers, Orthodox brothers, in uh, building this magnific magnificent church which still needs some fine details to be to be completed. I am truly mesmerized. I love every moment looking at it and uh, feeling so proud to be Serbian again 
at this moment. Enjoy. And the time has come to leave Belgrade, Serbia. Here at the uh, Nikola Tesla airport, getting ready to board the plane. This is where Berkonis plane is. Well, look at this really cool clock at the Amsterdam airport. It's cuts working hard. Very, very hard. Here we go. Okay. Minute has passed. Very cool.